Hey everybody, how's it going? This is Jujubee here coming at you from episode 9 of this Let's Play Minecraft Vanilla series. In the previous episode, we finished construction on the crop barn just on the other side of the Jujube tree. And in this episode, we are going on a little adventure to find some dogs, some pumpkins to start our pumpkin farm, and hopefully an NPC village. So sit back and relax everybody, and let's play some Minecraft survival. Alright guys, I know it has been a while since I uploaded a survival episode and it was kind of uh, the end of finals were coming and the holidays and I went to New York with my family and you can see those in the vlog on my channel and then the new semester started and I kind of wanted to get settled so I took a little break from Minecraft and um, but now we're back and I've done a little bit of work off camera as you can see if you're looking around here I have these um, bridges that I built I tried to do something a little um, architectural as you can see I kinda tried to add some uh, crazy designs with the different steps and slabs and um, blocks and things and then I added these little glass um, windows in the middle here so you can see down into the water I thought that was a really cool effect Although we got these janky tor torches, I really want to get to the nether soon so that we can get some uh, glowstone. But yeah, I added a little bridge here to get there, this bridge to get here, and then I added a super long one on the other side there to get to the barn and the other island. I converted the land here into a tree farm because I did a lot of work on the inside of the jube jube tree. I'm going to try and hide that from you. And I needed a lot of wood, so right now this is all fully blossomed. I haven't cut any down. I also added a path, as you can see, with all the polished granite that um, I made from the crap ton of granite that we had in the um, strip mine factory over there. So I did that. It didn't finish all the way. There's still a little bit to go over here. Oh, I know. I did finish it. Okay. <laughs> I forgot that I finished it. But yeah, I have this really long bridge over here, as you guys can see, and the glass um, windows as well. And this goes all the way over... Um, to this island where there's a little family of sheep that I've been um, <laughs> raising for some of the beds that I made in the jube jube tree. Our uh, barn is looking great. I added some trees on this side and we got our carrot farm now all fully bloomed and our wheat ready to be harvested. And we are pretty much self-sufficient on food now because harvesting this will give me about two stacks of carrots and just about two and a half stacks of loaves of bread which is insane so we are good on food but I do want to get some pumpkins and hopefully some melons soon so that we can start putting melons and uh, pumpkins back on the other side there so now I'm gonna go into the jube jube tree I want to show you guys what I did on the inside before we head off on our adventure and um, I kind of changed it from what we had originally with all the different floors and um, I'm gonna show you what I did so we walk in here and I took a lot of the, what are these called, logs away from the sides because I realized since the bottom is so thick, there's a lot of wasted um, logs and so I took a lot of that out and that helped with a lot of the wood that I needed. But um, So I made this sort of like a lobby area. We got plants, we got a lot of water works over here, we got a couple fountains, more plants. And I made a little fireplace with torches because we're not putting fire in our tree because that would just not work. And then back here I have our little, um, this is our little uh, temporary home where we have some of our storage. And then basically the entire tree is a stairwell that goes all the way up to the top of the tree into a bedroom. And I'm going to show you. So we come up here, we have a little balcony to look down, and then this goes all the way up round and round and symmetrical on both sides I added a bunch of windows so you can look out and see from all the different angles over here you can see uh, the construction of what is to come in the future episodes which is a secret I'm not gonna tell you what's going on over there yet but I have big plans for that little cliff over there and over here you can see the farmlands really well so now we're gonna come up here this is the bedroom we come into another um, fireplace with a mantle. We have ourselves a little hot tub in case we want to, you know, chill. <laughs> and then we come up here. We have a little balcony area. We can come out and look over at the graveyard and the sunset. And um, this uh, area here, which will become something soon when I explain over here, 
And um, then you can come up here and we have a little balcony up here with a, a master bed, three beds wide. Um, I want a closed stone in here, but all we have is torches, so until we can get to the nether, I just put a torch in there. And then we have our um, chest that was holding all this stuff. So yeah, that's what I've kind of been doing off camera every now and then when um, I was studying for my finals and on vacation in New York. Um, so yeah, <laughs> that's pretty much it. So now we're going to go down here. I'm, I stayed up for the past couple of nights, and I was hunting some skeletons. As you can see, I got 25 bones so that we can go and tame some dogs. I also managed to get some golden leggings with protection to unbreaking two from a zombie. And um, we got a couple rotten flesh, gunpowder, and string. We're going to need some gunpowder to make some TNT once again for that secret build I'm not telling you guys about yet. I'm going to take a nap though because it is nighttime. In the morning though, however, we are going to be going on our adventure to find some dogs and pumpkins and hopefully an NPC village, which would be sweet. Alright guys, it is morning. I just put all of those uh, mob drops into the chest and now we're heading off onto the distance to hopefully find some dogs. I'm just going to eat some bread. Alright. We got our tools, everything that we could possibly ever need. I brought the hoe. I don't think I need that. I got almost two stacks of bread, 25 bones, and 32 torches. And um, I know dogs live in the snow, so we're just going to go over here to the snow and kind of head off in that direction. God, there's an enderman. Oh, why is he out here in the sunlight? God damn it. God damn it. Ugh. But I think they live more in the forests. So let's just continue. Okay, he's going over there. Ooh, ooh, a ravine. Oh, 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 we're gonna have to definitely go and check that out. Ah! Ooh, that looks like a forest. Let's head over there. I really want some dogs. It gets kind of lonely on the island. I don't know what we're gonna name them yet. I want to give them some awesome ass names. If you have any ideas to name our dogs, um, leave it in the comment section below. Maybe I can get some ideas from you guys. We can get some gunpowder. Ah! Ah. No gunpowder. We got a bunch of flowers though. What? Oh, there's a dog. Oh my god. Did he just. What? My first bunny in Minecraft 1.8, and he killed it! Dog. He just murdered that rabbit. That hurts my heart. Alright, let's go see what's going on in this forest. Doggies! There's a chicken. I don't want a chicken. Let's see. I got a bone for you! Doggies! Hmm. Oh, another bunny! Oh, it's so cute! Can we tame these things? Look at him hopping around. Oh, he ran into the tree. Can we tame these things? What? 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 What, what was that? What? Was that another bunny falling? That's what it sounded like. They make cute little squeaky noises. Let me know in the comment section if we can tame these things. Because if we can, we are definitely bringing some bunnies back to the jupe jupe tree. And if they not, we're going to have a freaking bunny farm. With a shit ton of bunnies. Okay, there's tons of chickens. I want dogs, not chickens. Was that a dog? No, but it's a freaking chicken. Dropping some eggs. Thank you. I don't have that. I guess the only dog that we have is that rabbit dog that we found. Oh, another bunny. Hello. Look, this one is brown. He's too cute for the bunny. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I wanted to get at least two so that we can, um breed them, but I guess, oh, okay, I guess that's not happening. Alright, let's go see where that dog went, he's over here somewhere. Where'd that dog go? He came over here. This chicken is stuck in the water. I'll save your chicken! Oh look, he's hatching eggs. I don't have that, thank you. Where'd that dog go? The bunnies. Oh. Where the heck that dog go? 
head off? What the heck? I saw a dog, right? That was definitely a dog. Yes, because he killed that bunny. For some reason. I wish we could tame these bunnies. I don't know if we can, actually. If we could tame them, and they can attack things for us, that would be sweet! I would have some freaking attack bunnies. Guard bunnies. Oh my god, the sun's going down. And we're not gonna find any dogs today. We will not leave until we have dog. Where is the rapid dog? Me, me, me. Oh, oh, oh. Freaking chicken. Okay. Let's climb up here. Maybe the dog climbed up here. Alright, guys. It took me a little bit of looking, but he actually was in the back of this little cave here. Um. Yeah. <laughs> he was hiding from me. Rabbit dog. This must be his cave. This must be his secret cave. Alright. No, 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 no. We're going to try and tame him. No! No! Come back! Come on. Yay! Get him. Come on, day. A rabbit dog. I mean, it only took me freaking forever, but I got a dog. Woo! Where are you? Where are you? There you are. Oh, they're shooting at me, they're shooting at me. No! Let me roar! Come on, doggy! You were such a great help. Now the next goal today was to find some- oh my god. Some pumpkins. Oh, 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 he's leading me to the pumpkins. He, he's leading me to the pumpkins. They're that way? Uh, are they that way? Okay. Oh, 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 oh. He's gonna kill my dog. No! I saved your life. Come on, we're gonna go find some pumpkins. Alright, pumpkins. Do you guys see any pumpkins? I really have no idea what pumpkins spawn, honestly. I read somewhere that pumpkins are more rare than uh, diamonds. Which uh, kind of sucks because I never find diamonds. Okay. Do. Oh god. Pumpkins! There's pumpkins! He was right. Holy crap, he led us to the pumpkins. He knew that was insane. He led us to the pumpkins. Well, not really. We kind of made a dog leg. Ah, get it. Dog leg. No? Okay. And then the Enderman won't bother us. How do you make pumpkin- wait. How do you get pumpkin seeds? Okay, yeah. That's what I thought. Alright. Alright, guys. Oh, look. You can see the secret build. Bum 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 bum. One day we are going to take a, oh, oh, what was that? A boat, and we are going to travel to the distance forever until we find something. But not today. Let's um, <laughs> let's head home. <laughs> oh, there's home. Okay, I'm going to do. Where's the doggy? Look, there's your home. This is your home. This is the droop droop tree. And this is the droop droop tree tree forest. He don't like it. He's like, I want to go home. Too bad. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, you want to you want to look out the window? Or okay. <laughs> We'll let him chill there. He can just chill there in the, the temporary bedroom. So let's go plant the pumpkins before I end this episode. Oh, yep. Yeah. Okay. So we're just going to turn all this into seedage. I probably shouldn't have done that, but um, it's okay. And as you can see, I kind of started um, laying this out where I want stuff. So we're going to go ahead and get rid of it. So we'll put some here so they can grow on either side. Oh yeah, okay, I remember how I did this. 
All right, guys, so I managed to fill up all but one of this side of the farm, which is what I wanted to do, because I want this side to be melons. So that is absolutely great. We found just enough pumpkins to make what we needed. So these are starting to fertilize from our handy-dandy fertilizer, if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> and um, these are going to start growing. The sun is going down, so I'm going to head home. Got our dog. We got our pumpkins. I wanted two dogs, but one is just fine. And um, we got just enough pumpkins to fill up the farm that we needed. We didn't find an NPC village, but you know, beggars can't be choosers, so. In the next episode though, however, we are going to build a mob spawner. And uh, we're gonna build that just off the coast of our, um, I don't know if you can see. No, the trees are in the way. But um, just on the other side of the, um, Strip mines, there is a little baby island, and we're going to build a classic mob spawner, you know, with a really long cylinder and the um, really chunky tops. So, that will be what we will be doing in the next episode. But, however, today I am going to close it out so I can start filming the next episode. We managed to get done everything that we needed to, as I already said in this episode. So, I'm gonna take a nap because it is night and we don't want any spawning. Thank you so much for watching this episode. If you enjoyed it, leave a like. And if you haven't subs subscribed yet, hit the subscribe button. If you have any su ideas or suggestions of something that we should build or anything you think we should change about our world, please leave it in a comment in the comment section below because I would love to know what you guys have ideas. This has been Jujubee playing Minecraft Vanilla. See you guys in the next episode. Goodbye.